This is a special sunbed right here with a solar right here. And uh, these guys, they're actually charging their phones right here. Um, so this is perfect for the beach, no? It's perfect for the beach. You can power your mobile, your laptop, your even the solar DC refrigerator. That can is a DC compressor. Yeah. that we have patent this technology about power this refrigerator. This is dust. your mobile? Yeah, that's mine. It's charging? Yes, yes, it's charging. Cool, so so what do you have here? Here we have our uh, solar kiosk. When uh, anybody can uh, charge this phone, uh, the phones are charged by solar energy, which is produced by these organic photovoltaics on the roof. Also, the same uh, photovoltaics can produce uh, lightning until the night. Yeah. Uh, so you can have a little light at night. Yeah. So you can continue partying on the beach at night. Of course. <laughs> nice. You can have a portable. Yeah. A portable OPV panel. That you can take it everywhere. You can put your tent here. You can power it inside. Every that is a light device. Like, yeah, it's a cool tent, yes. Everything cool. that you need can be only a portable panel. And this power, this solar uh, panel can be lightweight, is only half a kilo uh, per square meter. It's uh, flexible, it's portable, and has uh, the needed power that can light you, your tent, that can power your mobile. And I feel that it's very cool. Nice. Uh, you say R&D manager, so how do you manage the R&D? How we manage the R&D? We are focused much about the processing and all technologies in order to optimize all nano layers of the multi-stack of OPV. We use different metrology and quality tools during the manufacturing. We perform inline and real-time um, monitoring of all uh, during the all manufacturing steps and we make automation that this automation can tune and control the parameters and this makes us to have very good OPV panels with great quality. Actually you have the, the world record last year right in, in terms yeah. of efficiency? Yeah, yeah. Uh, last year we achieved to have uh, with a single injection polymer OPV uh, sell the 7.4% uh, efficiency that was uh, a world record about the polymer-based, the flexible uh, photovoltaics. To be on every roof, all of the world, uh, this is potentially huge, right? This is just kind of this, this uh, market. And yes. uh, you have another demo over there? Yeah, we have another demo, Tassos. Yes. Uh... On our last but not not least demo, yeah. we have our uh, power parasol. Uh, we have a beach umbrella yeah. to produce electrical energy, charge your phone, even have a lighting. I think. So uh, uh, just charge. When you're just lying under a shade. Nice, and this could be potentially, uh, all this could be mass manufactured, could be uh, yeah, course, waterproof. All of all of our, every application of ours is ready to be made in large scale and commercialized. So uh, how much for a solar sunbed? I'm joking, but uh, hopefully with, the, with the sunbed? Every beach should just be able to, <laughs> to, to, to get this. Yeah, it's a very big market. For example, in Greece, tourism is going very great. It's increasing uh, every year. So more and more sunbeds uh, are needed to be here, also umbrellas. So the market is big and to whole Mediterranean countries like Italy, Spain, and so on. Uh, and uh, also this uh, kiosk, I found it also aesthetically that can be also in a yard or somewhere that you can put it, for example, here in Greece, many places, many regions not have uh, supported by electricity. So a kiosk like that can provide energy and power. So this, this is also important for the EU, for Europe, for Greece, potential huge market. Yeah, because uh, all this technology started from Europe it's good to uh, Europe to exploit all this uh, technology everywhere 
And why not from Greece? 